Reacted to Mr. Beast. Let's dive in. One dollar versus five hundred thousand experiences. Let's dive in by Mr. Beast. What a half a million dollar experience looks like. I promise. Dubai. This is going to blow your mind. In this video, you will find out. Oh what damn. Cost a quarter of a million dollars to simulate going to space. Okay. Okay. Fifty thousand dollars to explore the depths of our oceans. Oh. Oh. And every other experience we tried along the way. I am standing on top of the tallest building in the world. Whoa, that's no, I can't do that. Nope, nope. I don't care how expensive it is to go on the tallest building in the world. You cannot catch me up there. You got to pay me a billion dollars. No cap. Riding a camel. How long can I ride this camel for a dollar? One dollar, two minutes. Deal. Two minutes. That's a great one dollar experience. Yeah. Ooh. Hold on tight. Wait, hold on tight. Why? Oh, because they're about to set up. Yeah. Oh, my God. I wanted to ride camels in Egypt, but they're way more than a dollar. So I'm going to throw the pyramids up and post. Yo. Nice. It's Good period. Nice, nice, nice. I mean, I'm so high up in the sky. Now you know what it's like to be me and Chandler. Okay. Damn. Well, we personally? We two minutes, and that time is up. Let's go have dinner in the sky. For $10,000, you can go 3,000 feet in the sky with a chef who what? uses this hot air balloon as her kitchen. You can see the shadow from the balloon over there in the field. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. This I'm not going to lie. higher than I expected. I'm not going to lie. But this isn't your everyday dinner at 3,000 feet in the air. This exactly. star chef uses the flame from the hot air balloon itself to literally cook the food for the meal she's preparing. Miss the Beast. Oh, yo! That's Wait, what? Food, bro. Okay. Now we're about to have fish that they cooked with the fire from the hot air balloon. Oh, That's pretty cool. fire. I'm not going to lie. That's oh pretty God. cool. Jimmy, this is amazing. Look how beautiful it is down there. Such an amazing view while we eat. This fish never dreamed of being this high up. <laughs> if you got it, <laughs> you grand, wow. you want to impress a girl, I would recommend this. I, yeah, yeah, I would. Ten gourmet courses was I would. phenomenal, but I still had one question I needed to ask. As a Michelin star chef, what do you think of this Beastables bar? Very good in balance, and what I like is the crunch and the chocolate. Beastables is now Michelin star brew. The 10K Damn. experience was very beautiful. Amazing. Up next is the 50K experience. And 50K? Taylor, I have no idea what I have in store for them. 50k. I think it's beautiful. It's pretty. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think it costs 50 grand for the day? Uh, no. No. Okay. So look over I there. No, shouldn't. We're gonna go on a submarine expedition. Oh my god. You're okay, that's pretty ready cool. To the floor of the ocean? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's do this. Oh my. Oh, he's gonna swim to it. Okay. What? We're not doing that. Let's head over. Okay. Come on. Yeah. Let's go explore the floor of the ocean. Okay. All right. This is. Awesome. Wow, I can already see fish. Look, we haven't even gone down yet. Look at some That's pretty cool. If you guys want to scrape the floor of the ocean? We can. We can do anything. We have this entire submarine to ourselves and can explore whatever we want. Let's do everything. Except crash it. We are not yeah. allowed to do that. And to make sure we got the very best angles down here, we paid scuba divers to follow the submarine. Isn't it okay, cool? that's pretty cool. Let's communicate with them. Shark behind. Everyone freak out, okay? Start freaking out. <laughs> Damn. And while we're underwater, Tariq and Nolan are also on a fifty thousand dollar safari in Africa. And in Africa, what? More cool creatures down here than they do over there. Spoiler: We will. Probably, this but I think awesome. Africa is pretty right, fire, find though. The king of the jungle. We cannot leave Africa until we see a lion. Do you understand? Yes. I do understand. Why did you point at me like that? Look! 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 look. Oh, we're on! Yo, it's boom boom! You scared him! Oh, you scared him! I'm sorry, I shouldn't yell. I'm not supposed to yell. Zebras! I feel like zebras would take That's it. pretty cool. Like, if I was a lion, I, I would, I would definitely person. do this, Loki, like over going to the ocean. What? Hey, yo! Oh, this is so worth $50,000. He said he's saying it. This is so worth Jimmy's $50,000. Wait, Carl, what if instead of being a ship, that's a submarine? We're taking this thing back up immediately. Yeah, yeah we're going to the surface. Look how, how close we are to those rocks. Oh. oh. Is it okay how close we are? Yeah, yeah, it's okay. All right. But we weren't the only ones getting up close and personal. Zebras, where you going? Hey, buddy, wait. Oh, do you want to go closer to the giraffe? Patrick, let's talk about the elephant in the room. Well, there's two right behind you. Uh, there it oh, is. Here, unnervingly close. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's awfully oh, close. It is coming towards oh, us. Oh, oh, oh. He's got charged by an elf. It's, it's a lion. The coolest thing ever. Look That's him. cool. That thing is a unit. That's my dad. Mufasa. This is way cooler than a submarine. I'd rather see this than a fish. Also, my heart's beating out of my chest right now. Yeah, because you're so damn close. Experience. What we have coming up next is even better. 
This thing pales in comparison to the two hundred fifty thousand dollars zero gravity experience. This company will fly you up and then nose up, creating a zero gravity environment. And oh no! Oh my god! Two hundred fifty thousand. You gotta to control yourself with zero gravity. Bro, that means like the plane is pretty much doing this and then pulling some. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, this is sick. On this next drop, we're gonna race to the other side. Turn on zero gravity. Oh god. Okay, that's pretty cool. I would do. I would definitely do this. Besides me with the plane going nose down, trying to create the zero gravity effect for that. Turns out racing without gravity doesn't work so well. But luckily, Carl had a better idea. What? I'm gonna test out a leaf blower. All right, wait for it. Oh! He's spinning. Got a lot of control, it, bro. Before we turn the gravity off again, we're gonna try to make some of our Mr. Beast Lab swarms in zero gravity, right? Oh yeah. no, that's not gonna work. Bro, how many plugins they are, Jimmy? First feasible, your toys. Ever. All you have to do is pour water into the tube, shake it, and you'll find out which swarms you got. I'm gonna squirt some water. Give me some. Ow. Oh, that did oh, not work. By these toys right now. This isn't as easy as I thought, but anyways, there's over a 119 swarms to collect. You can find swarms in packs of 12, packs of five, and packs of two. Available at Walmart, Target, and Amazon in the United States. Bro, he's making bomb money off this thing, bro. Toy retailer. It's my favorite toy. I'm Go waitless. get it at your local Walmart. These are the most exciting toys this holiday season, and they're flying off the shelves. Carl, Ken. Make sure you buy Mr. Beast Labs before they're sold out. Oh, that's gonna be cool. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. Oh, no, no, catch. Oh, God. Yeah. It's, that, I think that's a GoPro, actually. <laughs> Five hundred thousand dollars experience to get a top this. Well, let's go find out. Five hundred, huh? Huh? Half a million? This is the craziest view of ever. Unlike any spectacle seen before in the history of wow, mankind, what is my that? And I are about to see what half a million dollars can allow you to experience in the most luxurious metropolis in the entire world. The Dubai. Of Dubai. A place carved from the desert, but created for pleasure. And at the end of this video, I'm going to become one of the few. I cannot be up there. My heart is beating for them to be up there. The tallest building in the world. We went all out. It is going to blow your mind. Let's go have some fun. How are we here? So after we found our way off this 500 foot picture frame, we made yeah, pretty much. to this castle of a hotel. Whoa. Wow. Oh, this that's pretty gas. Wait a minute. The first two floors of this hotel room are magnificent, but the coolest one by far is the third level. That's completely underwater. <laughs> oh, nah. Oh, 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 my God. Whoa. Welcome to Atlantis. We love you all, except for you, Carl. Damn, me personally? I went into a thing with sharks just to make fun of me. For the record, yep. there's over 80 sharks in this tank. And oh, nah, forget that. We're actually going to be swimming with them. And for the cherry on top to wrap all this up, come on, we're going to go skydiving. No way. Yeah, yeah, yeah nah, nah. From thousands and thousands of feet in the air. Don't worry about that. Let's go race F1 cars. Yeah, yeah. No, don't worry about that. Let's go race some cars. So at the Dubai Autodrome, home to some of the fastest cars in the entire city. Just grab it. Okay, okay. Let's go race. All right. Let's go. And I called up some of the biggest local creators to have a field day with these supercars. Bro, I will be tearing up the track with this thing. I'll be cooking up the track. I ain't catching me, bro. so fast. And this is just the first of many experiences we're going to be doing here. Bro, I would have been cooking up that track. Jimmy, no. right, they're driving so so I'll be hitting the gas on that day, bro. Hitting the paddle shift. I'll be drifting at the end. Yeah. You're on a ray track. Just hit the gas, girl. Oh, dang. Carl was getting ready to drive an actual Formula level race car. Wait, what? Let's do this thing. Off to a rocky start. Okay, that's pretty badass. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god, I'm driving a formula car. This is the best day of my life. Uh, that's pretty cool. We actually got to keep this brand new Lamborghini. I want to enjoy it a little bit. Get to keep it? 
Bro, let me let me get the lab ball. You don't need that, Jimmy. Let's go to an NBA game all the way in Abu Dhabi. But to be honest, guys, NBA I'm not game. the kind of guy who likes to drive around sports cars. And plus, we cannot find a parking spot. So I'm just going to find someone to get this thing to. Do any of you watch the Mr. Beast channel? Yep. That says subscribe. Can I just give you this Lamborghini? Uh, yeah. Uh, someone else to have it. What? What? what the heck just happened? Hey, sir, security, can you come over here? Oh, he's subscribed. Can I just give you this Lambo? Yeah, please. All right, get it? Oh, this yeah, yeah my team ain't got the security card. Yes, yeah, sir. <laughs> this is why you got to make sure you're subscribed. I'd hate for you to lose a Lamborghini. Hey, boys, what are you doing? We got court Yeah, get out of his car, Enjoy. bro. I'm so happy. With the Lamborghini now off my hands. Hey, the NBA. At a pro basketball game. <laughs> but instead, it just ended up turning into a photo shoot. Yeah, pretty much. Then afterwards, I said hi to Steve Harvey. Steve Harvey. And after that, Classic. Russell Westbrook. And with two hundred thousand dollars worth of experiences left to do, up next we got to take over a massive water park. Wow, that's crazy. Somehow, in the middle of the desert, hang out with penguins. I heard you're the alpha. That's pretty cool. That is an alpha thing to do. And since that wasn't enough, I am now in a giant pool with eighty sharks and stingrays. Hello there, sir. That's it. That's hey, pretty cool. Hey, come back here. I was trying to talk to you. It's like Buzz Lightyear. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Oh! Excuse me, sir. Yo, I got so cool. <laughs> I am Aquaman, the king of the sharks. My first decree is the sharks by him and not me. Damn, that's crazy. Oh, attack him! That is a dinosaur. I am your leader. Attack him! <laughs> that should not exist. I think they just unplugged my oxygen. Well, before this guy turns me into fish food, let's go get our own dinner at a restaurant straight out of the future. Hello, okay. everybody. Jamie, you go sit there. What is this? What is this, Jimmy? I don't know. I don't think I've ever sat at a restaurant this far away from my friends. Gentlemen. Prepare yourself for a once-in-a-lifetime experience. Oh, oh. Wait, what kind of experience? Oh, oh. What's going on here? Our first appetizer. Take it in one bite. Cheers. Cheers. One bite. What is what in the appetizer? Is it good? This is amazing. That whole plate was just that one bite. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh. Whoa. 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 It's like a Call of Duty mission. <laughs> Am I getting? <laughs> I thought this was a restaurant, not a movie theater. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> This nine course meal is surrounded nine by nine course meal interactive visuals that change based on the dish. Yo. Okay, that's pretty cool. It, oh, it responds to your touch. <laughs> Boys, we're now defending Earth. I'm impressively bad at this. But even though the room was impressive, dude, they're getting tripped up on my water right now. <laughs> Look at that. It was a one of a kind food and drinks that made interesting, this interesting. Really unique. You can touch the glassy to react with you. Uh, Okay, that's we pretty cool. Nine mouth-watering courses from freshly caught seafood. Whoa! Oh my God! To golden wagyu burgers. Okay, okay. You approve? Oh yeah. Hey, we found one Chandler likes. They even had one final course specialized just for us. Who is that? Who is Chandler? That is not. <laughs> what the? That is not me. <laughs> But anyways, let's keep the experience going. All okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Literally fall out of the sky and climb the tallest building on Earth. Is yeah, I got. Yeah, I'm not doing that. You, you can have that, Jimmy. Look at this. <laughs> okay, that view is oh beautiful. God. I would definitely do that. Whatever you're seeing right now does not do this justice. No way. Standing over 600 feet in the sky, this oh, that's very high. Infinity oh nah. A breathtaking view of every square inch of the city. Let's hop on in, boys. Yeah, I'm getting in. That island behind me is man-made. Everything about this is mind-blowing. Now we're gonna stick this bad boy over the ledge. Jeez. No, 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 no. It's time we fall from the sky. Wait, what? Yeah? <laughs> Dude, you're just falling to the earth. No, you're falling to this man-made island. Oh my god, I'm so scared. Buckle up, because what you're about to witness, I never thought I'd do in my entire life. Yeah, that Literal part. Maniacs, who does this willingly? But you? You're about to do it. Experiences be without attempting to face one of my biggest fears: falling out of the sky. If I don't make this, still upload the video. This is getting real. If you don't make it, no. Can I have the YouTube channel? Prepare for takeoff. Oh boy. What are the odds I die? I don't know. Oh my god. Oh, of course. Of course you don't know. We are Fight. so high. I'm not ready. Jimmy! 10,000 feet in the air. You're going first. Jimmy, I need you. I need you. No, he changed his mind too late. You out there playing now. Oh god. I'm scared. Bye, 
Glory, glory, what a hell of a way to die. Oh, man. You gotta jump out, Taylor. Just gotta go. Just lead into it. Uh, I'm scared. You scared? Yeah, we're still pretty high up. <laughs> this is probably my biggest fear ever. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. But I did yeah. this for you guys. Ah, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah, ah, okay. I'm not dead. I'm alive. Where's Taylor? Did Chandler not jump? Where's nah, Chandler? he didn't jump. Chandler either didn't jump or slotted on the ground. Oh, God, oh, I hope he oh no. <laughs> That'd be fucked up. Well, it's a good thing I didn't ask Chandler to join me on the biggest experience of this whole video. Yeah, that, that part. is the Burj Khalifa, the tallest building on Earth. Yeah, and no. This experience, I'm gonna go no. All the way on top of it. I catch me at 100 so floors. The that's it. And then higher than that, you got me bent. A series of elevators over 160 stories into the sky. 160 the stories? 100 feet, I had no choice but to climb to the top myself. This thing is tall. There's a lot of ladders. Oh, man, bro. You, you got it. You got it. I underestimated how hard it is to get up to the top. But even after a full hour of climbing, there was still a lot of skyscraper left to go. I thought Damn. I finally made it to the top, but there's still a lot left. Oh, man. This thing never ends. Step by step, I started to question whether I really wanted to keep going. I don't know if I'm going to make it. Surely we're almost there. <laughs> Take that as a no. He's like, but nah. All this endurance. I reminded myself that this was my moment to be one of the few individuals ever to experience standing on top of the tallest building on earth. I knew Woo! there was no you, you, Hey, after you right, skydive, I mean, what's, you know, this would be nothing, right? All right. I made it. I am standing on top of the tallest building in the world. Oh, boy, you got it. You got it. I ain't that crazy, but you got it. Holy crap, you got it, know. Jimmy. You got it, bro. Hell no. Nah. And, yeah, the, that's scary. and then and then you're putting your foot on the ledge like you about to fall, bro. We cannot. Uh, I'll admit, Beastable stays better on the ground because on the ground I'm not on the verge of passing out. I'm so afraid of heights. I find time and time again that when I face my fears, I usually end up enjoying it and learning a lot about myself. Yeah, I would have got down this experience, and I would encourage you guys to go outside your comfort zone. Do something you wouldn't normally do. Oh, um, definitely not that. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed all the effort we put in this video. I love you guys. You, are y'all doing this? Let me know in the comment section. Cause me, I, my, my head is spinning just like looking down and all that extra stuff. Comment below what's your highest floor you've been on. For me, it's been a hundred, hundred and the thirty second floor is the highest I've been. So, don't at me. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. If you guys enjoyed the video, catch you guys next time.